Dear Legosians, it's important to share with you my decision to venture into what I consider a much bigger facet of service to humanity. I am convinced it's best to hear directly from me. With my known career in the entertainment industry spanning over 25 years and the God-given grace to achieve quite remarkable success, I have had the privilege of access to work and engage with people from all walks and strata of life. Within this period, I've watched with great concern the plight of the less fortunate, especially in the youth category. And this drifted me towards my less popular but equally strong passion, which is to help, assist, and contribute to the growth of youths, women, and children. I was raised by a strict teacher father who retired as a school principal and a caring mother who is a medical doctor to be hardworking and to have value for life. Therefore, dignity of labor and compassion for the needy became second nature to me and resulted in the birth of the Jennifer Foundation. With this, I've been able to reach out and help the youths by providing job opportunities and welfare to those in need. I am a Lagosian, born out of Ikorodu. So when the Lagos PDP gubernatorial candidate, Dr. Abdulaziz Olajide Adediron Jando, asked me to be his running mate as a deputy governor in the next year's gubernatorial election. I saw it as an opportunity to help liberate and improve the welfare of our people, particularly the deprived youth, women, and the girl child. My decision is not only to accept this huge responsibility, but also to work tirelessly and complement Jando's burning desire to see our dear state of Lagos live up to its full potential with the people as immediate and direct beneficiaries. Over the years, a lot of young people have been ignored, victimized, maimed, for daring to have a dream. So I use this opportunity to call out all well-meaning residents of Lagos, especially the youths. It's indeed time to use our numerical strength to our full advantage. It's time to take our rightful place in matters that concerns our lives and our future. It's time to rally ourselves and support our own. I am not unaware of the cost of this assignment in my vibrant career which I must now necessarily put on hold. It's a huge personal sacrifice, but my resolve is that no sacrifice is too much for the actualization of the urgent mission to rescue our people and our dear state. I must express my deep appreciation both to our party leadership and our gubernatorial candidates for considering me worthy of such a great call to serve our people. It's a call that I take with reverence and utmost sense of responsibility. Indeed, we can achieve a Lagos that truly works for all her residents as opposed to a privileged, hand-picked few. So let's do it. Given your mandate, be assured that the people's governor, Dr. Olajide Adediro, with the support of my humble self, represent the much-needed breath of fresh air in Lagos. Thank you. I am Olufunke Akindili, PDP Deputy Governorship Candidate, Lagos State.